even if you're bringing home the bacon, <laughs> chances are buying staple items like meat, dairy, and fresh produce are making you take a second look at some of those grocery store prices. Store price is getting really close to what ours is, and, and comparable, ours is the same or even a little bit less than any of the rest of us local producers that we have. For local Missoula farmer John Turner, he has been balancing running his farm while trying not to raise his prices. Uh, here we've got, there's probably about 75 birds. But it's getting harder. Our input costs, the hay for our animals, the, the feed for our animals is going up. Local farmers aren't the only ones feeling the compounding effect that high prices have. Owner of Burnt Fork Market in Stevensville, Jim Edwards, says he's seen prices fluctuate. But last year, prices started going up when the gas prices start, started going up. Which has shoppers paying more at checkout for things like eggs and meat. Edwards says that he's seen egg prices jump from $129 to $199 and sometimes even $299. But local Montana farms have their eggs sold here for upwards of $7. I think everybody, I mean, everybody is trying to hold stable. And back at the farm, Turner says he's doing what he can to keep prices for meat, eggs, and fresh produce at a low, despite production costs, with relief hopefully coming soon. We've tried not to raise the prices like everybody else has, but as we can only hold out so long. In Missoula, Hannah Hislop, MTN News.